Well, now the rugs for sale with images of the September 11 disaster. As Damien Murphy reports, they've sparked widespread anger and disbelief. I lost my uncle. Did you really? In September 11. It's the imported woven rug <laughs> that's got them hopping with rage. It hurts. And made in Afghanistan. He said that they were collector's items. For sale in Australia. Do you find that offensive? I don't think so. We're rolling out the rug. All over town. A disgrace to mankind. And getting the same response. You wouldn't have it at your house? No way. Wherever we go. I don't think this is something for this country. So I've just been down to the rug shop. After your complaints about a very offensive image, we sent our staff to this Persian rug emporium on Sydney's North Shore. Well, um, here's what we got. September the 11th, 2001. Here's an aeroplane here about to hit the tower, and this one's already crashed. Hello, gentlemen. How are you going? Hello. How are you? I'm very well. I'm very well. How much was it? It was supposed to be $190. I got it for $150. Is it wrong to be profiting from it? You're not profiting from that. It's 150 bucks. Yeah, it is 150 bucks. I found this within two minutes of being in the shop. You can't miss it. You can't miss it. When people see this rug, what do they say? They love it. They love it? Yeah, they love it. <laughs> well, we rolled out the mat on a city sidewalk. That deserves to go in the river. I mean, you know that that's how they are, these extremists. But seeing it just makes your hair stand on end. Makes my heart beat very fast. I'm sorry, I can't look at it anymore. We also rolled it out at Kayser Trad's front door. He's head of the Islamic Friendship Association. My first impression of this is this is very poor taste. This is not something that we need. But then he cast a close artistic eye. The message I read is that destruction to the Twin Towers, war comes to Afghanistan, hope for peace with the dove across both flags. Do you think there's a positive message here? Uh, maybe I'm optimistic. I think the dove gives us the message that let's maybe put that violence behind us. You're absolutely right. Professor Tim Bonnyhady is an Afghan art expert. Far from being a celebration of destruction, these rugs are an expression of hope that peace would come to Afghanistan. What's this down here? I don't know. I couldn't figure it out. I said to him, what's this? And he said, I don't know, probably a dead body. In the middle, the dove of peace, and it's uniting uh, the Afghan flag and the US flag. In fact, it's carrying an olive branch and all. So that's a very poor representation. It's definitely true that over time, these things get um, reproduced again and again, and the imagery often gets scrambled. Like all art, it's interpretation. It's very cryptic. Some will never be sold. Would you have that in your house? No. But there's always an admiring eye. It's beautiful. Well, it is provocative. It is easy to see how it'll upset some people.